Okay, hey everyone, QB King 77 here from the AC Syndicate team here with uh, a bunch of Sprint phones actually going to show you guys an app that can help, help you determine whether or not you have carrier IQ on your device. So this app is still in development stage, but it still works pretty well. And I'm just going ahead and going to show you the reason I have it ordered this way. I have my top two phones, the Samsung Epic 4G and the Samsung Epic 4G Touch. Those are both stock and both should have carrier IQ. The reason I have these bottom three, the Nexus S 4G, Motorola Photon 4G, and HTC Evo 3D, the 3D is running a no CIQ ROM, the Synergy ROM from uh, Trevi, the developer that actually deleted, uh, removed carrier IQ from HTC devices on Sprint and is basically has the video showing it in action with an ADB log. But otherwise, I have the Motorola Photon 4G and the Nexus S 4G. Both are, I believe, no, the Nexus S 4G is running a ROM, but the Motorola Photon 4G is completely stock. But neither of these two should have CIQ either. Um, Nexus S 4G, I believe, doesn't. I don't think Google would allow that, and the Motorola Photon 4G doesn't. My guess is because it's an international phone. That's just my guess, though. But otherwise, uh, when I run the log, it's actually an app. Um, let me grab the 4G Touch. App from the market. It's called Voodoo Carrier IQ Detector. Right there. Big thanks to Super Curio for putting this app together for us. It is in development stage still, so you should see some updates to it soon. But otherwise, it's just a, a development app. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how to, how to run it. So I'm going to go ahead and go to my app drawer and put it on my home screen. So as you can see, it's called Voodoo Simple. So select it, and it should do it right away. So basically, it finds it. Um, detection score, if you have a number there, it's determining that you do have it. Um, it. It gives you running processes, system services, uh, ROM binaries. So basically, it just kind of runs through, and it says Android log head, debugging log, confidence level 100. So it definitely has carrier IQ. I'm, I'm stock on my Samsung Epic 4G Touch, so it's definitely going to have carrier IQ. So it definitely works on that note. Also, I'm going to go ahead and run it. So let's go ahead and run it on the Nexus S 4G and see what comes up. So I'm going to go to the Voodoo Simple app. And as you can see, zero, nothing found, nothing found, nothing found. So as I said, I doubt the Nexus S 4G has carrier IQ, which is determined by this app. And also I'm going to go to the Photon and it shouldn't have carrier IQ either. So I'm going to go to the Voodoo app. As you can see, oh, it looks like uh, it has a few numbers actually, but it still says nothing found underneath all of them. So detection score zero, so it definitely it doesn't have carrier IQ either as expected. Now let's go ahead and um, actually the numbers don't really mean anything, I don't think, because yeah, it, it doesn't because uh, it's just the confidence level that nothing is there. So sorry about that. But anyways, go to the Samsung Epic 4G and go to the Voodoo app. And there you go, detection score 540. So it definitely sees it in ROM binaries, system services, running processes, Linux kernel, Android logcat. So yeah, it's definitely prominent in stock EI-22 on the Epic 4G. And as I said, Evo 3D shouldn't have it because I'm running the no CIQ ROM. So I'm gonna go to it. And detection score zero. So definitely removed from the Evo 3D, but as you all know, it is on there when it's on stock. But otherwise, that is just a quick test of the Voodoo uh, Carry IQ detection. You can actually get it from the market. Just search for uh, just search for Carry IQ in the market, and you should be able to find it. But other than that, let me know what you think about this. Definitely an issue considering Carry IQ is on a lot of devices, especially on Sprint, but it could definitely be on other devices. Let me know if you run this on other devices that I don't have here, and let me know what your if it detects it or not, if you're on a no CIQ ROM or not, if you're on stock, let me know. I'm curious to see what other devices pop up with this app. So another thanks to Super Curio for this app, letting us detect it on our phones without having to run an ADB logcat, which I know some people aren't very familiar with. But otherwise, that's the Carry IQ detection app on your Android phones. 
Be sure to subscribe to me for future videos. I'll keep you updated on Carry IQ news as well as get how to's going as well. Uh, be sure to like me on Facebook, Twitter, Google Plus. Links in the description of the video. And be sure to give this video a thumbs up. Thanks for watching.